smells like pee. <laughs> Parking was a nightmare. <laughs> Unless you wanted to pay 10 bucks and then it's easy. Yay! <laughs> okay, so let's just see if there's some food. I want a beer. Right. Check this out. Hello. Here. Sorry, it's so loud, but yeah. Ooh, they got a good spot there. I definitely want to stop there and have a beer. So they have shampoo naz or something. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. Chips and guac. I don't know, chips. It's not really that good for you, right? Rock sounds good. Cold beer. I know. Cold beer is a very good either. Oh, San Miguel, 350. Ooh, happy hour. Wait. Hold on. This is like 1970s pricing over here. What is happening? Hold on. What is this? Holy moly. What is this? I'm trying to see. Oh, rice. No, I had rice. I don't. I'm a big ricer. I'm a big rice fan. Let's see. What do we want? Let's see. Ooh, Golden Road Brewing. Well, that looks kind of good. I definitely want a beer, whatever I'm doing. Has anybody been here yet? I am starving. What is over here? Hold on. All kinds of like dried little goods and things. Okay. What else? What else? Burgers. No, oh, I'm not a burger. PBJ. You can buy. You can buy PBJs here. One of the best in America. It says. What? Why? Little oh, horchata. Wait a minute. Chili relleno. I don't really eat cheese, so that's not gonna work. So look good to you. Are you hungry yet? Okay, oh everybody's waiting for this place. I'm not a Chinese -er, though. Nah. Ooh, the fruit looks good. Wow. Look how fresh. Oh look at these. Wow, papaya. Ooh. 149 a pound. Hey, that's pretty good. A little watermelon. I still have an organic watermelon at home. The fruits, the fruits. I don't know what's with this jicama. I, I don't know. I'm sorry. I've tried it so many times. It's just not my jam. What, oh, this is a cactus. It's pretty good. Oh, 250. They're good prices. Oh my god, the candy aisle. Wait, no. Get me out of here. I can't do candy. Oh my god. What? So good. I have everything. Oh my god. <laughs> All the nuts. It's actually pretty cool in here. It's kind of hot outside. Octopus, scallop, shrimp, cilantro. Wow. I don't know. I don't like going to places that aren't like busy, busy, but oh, those peanuts look really good. I always get fat when I eat peanuts, so I'll take a break on those. Oh, they got more. Oh, they got all the like Mexican candies and stuff. Ooh, gummy spicy mango. What? That's amazing. How are you? <laughs> Good. Checking out your stuff. Wow. Too good. Oh wow, this jam looks amazing. What? Oh my god, that's peeling. 
think I've ever seen that. Oh, they have the good ginger. Oh, wow. Look at that mess around. Oh, look at this. They've got everything in here. Oh, dates? I need dates, actually. Hmm. What is that? Right egg. <laughs> oh, I love these stupid things. Mexican gum broth. What? Okay, we gotta find some food. I'm starving. Thank you! <laughs> wow, I'm so hungry. Um... Oh, wow, check this out. What is happening? The lights are glowing. Oh my god, look at this. Oh, this is a little flower, uh, what is it called? <laughs> Butterfly. Oh, this is cool. Here, I'm gonna turn around. Okay, I'm a butterfly now. <laughs> I gotta find something though. I paid ten dollars for parking. Okay, I'm gonna find something. Hold on. What is this? Lucky Bird. Oh, they have a. Uh, oh, the beer looks good, but I need to eat chicken and waffles. That's not my jam. I've had that before years ago. Not much of a chicken or anymore. I'm so picky. Oh my god. Do you like cookies? I have a lot of cookies. Oh, look at that dark chocolate brownie. What? This is the eat and fat, fat and flour pie shop. Oh, I got coffee. Oh, wait, key lime pie. Wait, what? Chocolate chest pie. Kombucha. Ugh. Gross. Sorry. I tried kombucha in the 90s and it was awful then and it's awful now. Bionico, gazpacho, chalupa, cucumber boat. Hmm. You have fruit? That's all I ever eat is fruit. I want something different. World famous lobster roll. I'm not a big lobster person. I, I think crab is better. Oh, look, they have the sea urchins. I feel so bad because I saw those when I was swimming in the Caribbean and they're like, oh, I feel bad. Oh, they have the oysters though. Okay, maybe try some oysters. Let's see. Oysters, Rockefeller, soft shell crab. little birdie over here. Don't mind the birds. Uh, caviar, sea urchin. Oh, it's in Santa Barbara. Where is the... Is that just regular oysters? Wait. I'm so confused. I need to look at another menu. This is bizarre. Every... What is it? Oh, Thursday through Sunday, every weekend. Oh, it's a weekday. We're not gonna have that. So maybe we just sit down or something? Are people ordering? Hold on. So I guess you just eat out of to-go stuff. Uh, I don't know, they just have regular oysters? I'm gonna have to ask the lady. You just have like regular oysters? No, we're, no. Just, we're not allowed to sell them. You're not allowed to sell them? Correct. So we can only offer them in the base rapid salad, or oh. we can also offer them, but in the seafood salad. So it can't be the raw oysters in the Oh, well, never mind then. Thank you. It's okay. You can't serve raw oysters. What the fuck? They're trying to, the government again is trying to protect you from having fun. You can't have fucking raw oysters. What? Well, I've had them. I went to a French place and had them. They were super good. 
so this is maybe a bus. <laughs> what is this? There's a wedding chapel. Hold on. What is happening? I know, nobody's here. You're here though. Yay, he's here with me. <laughs> no, the people keep coming in and out. We got a smoke shop across the street and a wedding chapel. So you get your, your you know, smoke your brains out and then go get married. <laughs> but there's some cool stuff. Like, I don't know, I'm at the Grand Central Market. I'm. It's a bust. I came for oysters and they don't serve raw oysters for some reason. I guess some technical difficulty. <laughs> Oh, yeah, exactly. Vice versa. Ugh. So, oh, this beautiful dog. What's happening there? Is that weird or what? Yeah, I don't want to cook the oyster. That's just like sacrilege. Okay, so we're going to have to make do. Fuck, I was going to eat a piece of fish or something. I don't even, they don't even really have any good, like, a piece of fish, right? That's weird, right? Okay. Obviously, that's not the place. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I had uh, gotten some fresh ones from, uh, where is it? They came from Washington State, and they were the best oysters I've ever had in my life. But we had them at this French restaurant, and it, yeah, they were like mega expensive. But my friend was paying, so <laughs> thank God he's very generous and totally, you know, paid for everything. I'm very grateful. I don't think I should start with chocolate ice cream because that's kind of you know right I don't know some people have dessert first oh this is the breakfast place oh my gosh wood fired pizza hmm. what's up here let's see oh it's very cute signage crying tiger steak I don't know what that means <laughs> Drunken noodles. Oh dear. We may have to go back to the chips and salt. What is it? <laughs> Guacamole and chips when I walked in. That may be what I end up having. Let's see. I'm, I'm holding out. I'm going to try to find some sort of seafood thing. I'm surprised that there's not more seafood. Right? This is like chicken stuff or something. Yeah. No, it's not it. Not it. Tacos. Uh, the love of pasta. Let's see. Well, how's it going, you? Here, here. Sorry. I'm a wreck. I went swimming, so my hair was a disaster. But the ocean is now up to 70 degrees, so you can finally um, swim in the ocean now. Let's see. Donut Man. Do you want to see the donuts? Hold on. Are you a donutter? I'll try to zoom in for you. I used to like those French crullers when I ate donuts, but no, I don't need any of this stuff. I don't need anything anymore. Actually, every once in a while I have something, but very rare. Very rare. Usually after I do like a cleanse or something. Those strawberry ones look good. Oh yeah, this guy's the famous guy. I remember having those in like, oh my god, 99 or something. Ages ago. This guy is like super famous. Yep. The Donut Man. If you ever come to LA, you gotta go to the Donut Man. Alright. I'm gonna go back to the front. Roy, oh my god. <laughs> I, I uploaded uh, some stuff. I was struggling because I thought everything disappeared. It, they had archived half my stuff and I was like, it took me a minute to figure out where everything was. So I released some videos and there's one coming tomorrow I put on there. There were some of the old ones I did. But we're just checking out the market. Let's we'll say hi. hi. <laughs> oh my God. This is a small group, but we're having fun, right? <laughs> Hi, there you are! Hi! Everybody's so friendly. <laughs> Everybody's so nice here. Hi! <laughs> Good! Okay, let's see. What are we doing? What are we doing? 
Oh, cards preferred. Look at this. Must be exact change. <laughs> what is this? Hi. Oh, this is a desserty place. Let's say it's closed for now. Let's see. Got all kinds of fancy cheeses and things. Oh, so my honey would love this. Tastes like fancy cheese. Stinky cheese. I'm sure there's a lot of stinky cheese in here. What is that stuff? It's like brown. Now this thing is called the Downtown Central Market. So they have all kinds of different things and like cool stuff you can't get other places. Look at this anchovy. Oh, see? I would love to get these for my boyfriend, but he'd kill me if I spent $20 on anchovies. I'm like, why are you spending money? <laughs> Well, the olives look good though. Italian olives, feta cheese, and they're kind of some fancy stuff. Gioia, I can't just pronounce this. Yes, I know I haven't been over at the beach chat in a while. I don't know why, I, I guess I have a lot on my mind right now. <laughs> I'm trying to sort out my life. <laughs> There's a lot of introspection going on right now. Oh my god. Maybe I'll just sit down and have the chips and guacamole. I don't normally eat chips, but I don't know. Maybe. There was one place that looked kind of cool. I'm bummed though. No seafood. Here, I'm going to check this. Oh wait, this place says seafood. Hold on. Let's check this one. They got cute little hoodies and stuff. Sorry, my face. What a bad hair day. Oh, there's a new chick. New chick in town, huh? Here, I'm gonna go to this one. Tell me what you think about this one. $13 for chips and guacamole. Is that normal? I don't know. I know, who's the new chick? I haven't been over there. I don't know. I'm not up on all the stuff. What's the gossip? Spill the tea on the new chick. Okay. Fish fried. No, I don't do fried. Octopus. It's not my thing. You're closed? Oh, they're closed. Oh my God. Smoked ahi oh, would have probably been okay, but. It's fine. I guess we're having beer for dinner. <laughs> yeah, you, you're really good. Alright, so I guess... <laughs> I don't know, there's no food happening. I mean, I need to eat some chips, but I may have to. I need to get these $10 parking. Uh, my money's worth or whatever, right? It's a combat. I'm trying to see what's over there. Look at this flying pig. It's like it's totally cool. Yeah. It's like a little light. Oh my god. Okay, so this place looks cute. I don't think they have food though. Wait. Oh wait, oyster. Hold on. Forty dollars for twelve? Wait a minute. That's a little more than normal. You may have to break out the credit card. <laughs> Where is it? Where, is that this place? Oyster Gourmet? Or is that the place that's closed? Oh no, they have them. Were they good, the oysters? Yeah? They're good. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Oh dear. <laughs> Let's see. How much do we want? Six for 20. Oh, we'll see they got up too. Okay, so we found the oyster spot. Okay, well there's a spot here. Should I sit right there? Let's see. Oh no, here we go. Here's a spot. Oh, it's reserved, ordered before sitting. Oh wait. Oyster, beer, wine. How many oysters should I get? Forty dollars, huh? This is to be on a budget. Thank you.
36. Uh, or you can get something else. They got spicy tuna for 15 bucks. Oh, let's see, let's see. Everybody's getting their cars towed. I was driving around looking for parking and everybody was parked in the no parking. Like, cause it says no parking four to seven. And I don't, there's so many signs in LA. Like it's very hard to, like you really have to read the sign. If you're a little bit slow or confused, just pay for parking because this shit is expensive. Oh my God. God knows it's probably gonna be what, 400 bucks to get his car back? And can you imagine walking up and it's up there and there's nothing you can do? Oh my God. I'm pretty good about the signs though, but I, you know, I just pay the damn $10. Okay, I think maybe, I could totally eat a dozen, but I don't wanna be a, you know, I have salad at home though, so maybe I should just get six. What about six and a couple beers? Do you guys want to hang with me when I have a beer? I get more fun when I have a beer. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. Okay. Um, let's see. Oh, these guys left. I can sit here. Ooh, gotta sit here. It's, I don't know if the music's too loud for you though. Tell me if the music's too loud. Hi. Um. Uh, what, what, what kind of beer is it again? I see Pacifico. Is there anything else? That's it. Oh, look at you. <laughs> well, it's a good thing I love it. <laughs> okay, so I think I'm going to do a Pacifico and then six of the oysters. Okay, come on this side. Okay. Over there? Okay. Okay, I'm going to sit over here. Oh! Six oysters and anything else? Uh, six oysters and a Pacifico. Did you cash or no? You do? Uh, actually, I need that for tomorrow. either way. I'm trying to get the close-up on the oyster situation. I'm still in Florida so I do uh, I'm not afraid of an oyster. So where I lived um, in Florida, well I guess maybe it was everywhere, I don't know. I didn't travel much. But we would uh, have, sorry I'm trying to get comfortable. So there were so many oysters happening there that like, you know, people would use that as like a makeshift 
like instead of having a dirt driveway, they would sh throw all the oyster shells in the driveway, uh, like of the restaurants and stuff like that, right? But you can like cut your feet on them sometimes. Oh, thank you! Wow, thanks. <laughs> the Baja, okay, cool. Thank you. Okay, cool, thank you. Uh, horseradish sounds good. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Oh. Cool. Turning around. Put you over there. All right. All right. I'm sorry to get you with the hell. Am I doing? Is there live music? I hear a guitar. Here is good. I was in the sun earlier. You know, Shelby. Let's see here.
Why? No, me and my uh, my boyfriend we had a heart to heart, and yeah, now we're kind of having a lot more synergistic, uh, <laughs> a lot more synergistic um, relationship, you know. So far, I mean, I don't know. We'll see. I hope it all goes well. I think so. I'll tell you one thing though. So like, I get these like visions and stuff like that. Visions. It's not not while I'm sleeping. It's I don't know. It just happens. I get these weird visions, right? Then they come true. Uh, and I did have a vision about me and my boyfriend several years ago. That like we were at the altar. <laughs> And so we've, we've, since then we've broken up and then we've almost broken up a couple times. And so it's like, um, what's happening? But I had that vision and all my visions are always true. So how, are, how is this not working out? But I guess maybe we just had to get over that hump or something. I don't know. So for now we're uh, working on it, you know. But no, it's been good. shutting your mouth. <laughs> okay, ready? Get out. Oh. Little Baja. I haven't been to Baja in a while. I went to, uh, I went camping on uh, San Felipe at the beach. And it's super, super hot. Oh my God. Uh, we ended up being there for the Baja 500, and that was pretty cool because I love all that motorcycle stuff. No, I didn't have my motorcycle <laughs> shirt on. That's me. Actually, I'm trying to sell my motorcycle. If anybody's in local and you want a CB1000 for $2,900, that's my drop dead price. Come on over right away. I need to just sell everything and get like one regular one. I got two e bikes. Also selling a 1975 RD350 two stroke. The thing's a beast. Little uh, Widowmaker machine. And then there's also a, another vintage one. It's a 1975 Honda. It's like a. a 404, CB 400, right? 404 is a super sport though. Uh, it's the like cafe racer kind of one. So, pretty one spike. Let me know. I got plenty of them. It's a trike. A trike, that's like a big deal. That's like a whole statement, a trike. <laughs> You're like a special kind of person. I actually sold, sold a trike before when I worked at the motorcycle shop. I can't really get you on the good view here, hold on. Let me get you on the slurp view. Slurp cam. This is looking really good. That's pretty good. Nothing, nothing can be on those uh, Washington State ones, the cold water oysters. Damn, what? It's kind of like buttery-ish or something. But it's amazing. She smashed it. Oh my god. That sounds scary. Like drinking it like water. <laughs> it's so the dry home. No, this was where the I'm happy now. I didn't even know. I didn't even know they had oysters here. I just saw that weird sign on the side. I guess everybody else knew. Everybody was, everybody's eating them. He even had the Oyster Festival shirt on, so it's like I feel good about this. Place. But I did find out that this, if you're local, the Santa Monica Seafood does have those Washington oysters sometimes. So if you go down there, you know, you can get them. And I think uh, once I was at Whole Foods and they had a bunch, and they said they have a special on Fridays or something, and I'm like. Yeah, but special with seafood, right? Like, is that the old stuff? I don't want any old seafood. You know what I'm saying? It's like, no. I want the good stuff. I'll pay extra for the good stuff. But no, six is perfect. I still have a little salad in me at home, so. 
can't eat that. The salad lady is like all I eat now. I guess it's all I've ever eaten. I don't know. No, I used to eat more of like rice and uh... Holy moly, I'm on. You gotta see this. I just noticed one of the, um, the ne- oh, The neons? Oh, I have 50% left of the battery. Shit, okay. Well, hold on, let me turn around. Look at this. Watch your pickle back. And she's standing on him! It's hilarious! <laughs> and there's this weird guy in the tub. I don't know. <laughs> and then the legs. <laughs> it's like too funny. After a beer, it's like they start looking better, right? And then there's the the peace, fire peace thing. What? Fire peace? Peace fire? What? Oh, Art's here. Hi, Art. She's, she got hurt. Oh, God. Oh, sorry to hear that, Hugh. Medicine bottles. Something smells really good all of a sudden. I don't know what it is. I used to have neon in my house. I love the water though. Oh, that's that was me earlier, except I didn't have high heels on when I was swimming. But I was in it for sure. And I got some this is like the best neon, right? I have a ton of good neon here. Oh, that was me. I was in my bikini earlier, the blonde hair. Oh wait, she's a mermaid. I just got that. She's in a drink glass. Conserve water, drink whiskey. Yeah, we just had these new, they just passed the thing in Santa Monica. I can't water my lawn but twice a week and I'm like, oh my God. So it's gonna be dead. Whoa, look at these creepy fingers up there. What is that? Oh, it says LA, get it? Ha 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 ha. If I can zoom in anymore, that's as much as it's gonna zoom. Ole LA, ole LA, la 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 la. Is that that song? Hot, hot, hot. I'm such a dork. <laughs> No, this is like the best jam. Look at the sharky shark. Oh, I love that with the water. Maybe I should get water uh, neon for the house. What do you think? Maybe I should like create my own neon art. What do you think? <laughs> I could totally do that. I'm an artist. I could do it. Fortuna! I just saw you. I'm staring at the thing. Okay, now I'm going to turn you back around. We got two more oysters to consume here. We're having an oyster party. I have to stick my, my giant butt out while I'm sitting <laughs> here. There's like all these different games like this in the car. Hey, what's with no thumbs up? Come on, man, push the thumbs up. What the fuck? <laughs> You guys are slipping on me. Come on, I need you. <laughs> no, I don't know. Um, I don't know if Roy's still here, but I had. Uh, I always get those. Uh, thank you. <laughs> I always get those damn copyright claim things, but I don't understand because like I'm not a monetizable channel, so I don't have enough people yet, right? But maybe it's selected somewhere, so I need to like, since I do everything on my phone, you know, I'm like, oh, I hate this broken computer, but I do have a new one, so. Once I started, I'm fine, but normally I'm like, I don't want to sit at the computer, I just want to be free, you know. But then once I sit there, I know, like, I like it. Because I, I got a cute little, um, I got a girly pink computer, it's like this uh, metallic pink. It gets really hot though, so I have to have the cooling pad. So, I don't know, it's like slim computer, but it, I can't go anywhere with it without the cooling pads. It's not really slim, so it was kind of a, it didn't really work out, but gosh, I look tired. I didn't get much sleep. <laughs> we lost somebody. Oh my God, okay, so, what am I talking about? Oh, Neon. I actually had some ideas about doing, uh, what do you call it? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Terrible um, I really wanted to do like some glass art and um, it's funny because I'm talking about neon. That's just kind of glass-ish. Glass and gas. Glass and gas. I guess every gas is a different gas. It's a different color, right? It's kind of wild. Um, but I don't know. It's just such a big deal to get the equipment to the big glass, right? But what I wanted to do is get like this big, thick piece of glass and just like blow on it like and like melt it and like do stuff with it but it's kind of like a dream or something i don't know if i'm ever gonna get that right now. 
It seems like a huge expensive gas is super expensive. Uh, and then, you know, I mean, I did look at that thing that's, uh, what is that lens they have in the, uh, remember the old projection TVs? What is the name of that? There's a weird lens in there. There's a, it has a funny name with a silent letter in it. Shoot. Anyway, so you pull up that thing that projects it. And what you do is you make a little stand for it and you put it where the sun is, right? And so the sun goes into it and it creates this fucking like laser beam, right? <laughs> well, you have to be careful because you could like burn your arm off or something. <laughs> Shit. So I was like, oh, I could just do that, you know, because it's like free from the sun. And I'm like, yeah, but I know myself and I can totally see me like burning myself or something, you know, and like, you know, smoke a joint or something and just forget what I was doing. Oh, it's so funny, my eyes match my shirt. Whenever I wear this color, my eyes turn the same color. It's really weird. <laughs> I mean, they're usually pretty greenish, but they turn super green, you know, you can really notice it. And oh my God, I didn't even think about that. I go in my eye, holy shit. Oh, it just burned my face off. I mean, it's like serious because like you're melting glass, right? And it has to be, I think, 3000 degrees to melt glass. Like. I think 900 if it's a special kind of glass. But yeah, so I don't know, it's probably not safe. <laughs> like if you have it in a little, you know, pistol, the little gun thing, and you're shooting the, the flame at your glass, you know, then you have kind of control over it. You have the little trigger or whatever it is. And, um, but I don't know. I'm like, well, I can hook it up to the gas at the house. I have natural gas. I can like run a tube or something. <laughs> to blow the house up. <laughs> this is what happened. I, I started parking the motorcycle inside the house and then I was reading this thing saying, well, you don't want to do that because what happens is the gas fumes, right? The gas fumes are different. What they do is, like say, the fumes come out of your tank of your motorcycle and they drop to the floor and then they seek a fire source. So it's like cruising your floor looking for pilot lights, right? Oh shit, what? Thank God, uh, I think your, your pilot light has to be 18 inches off the floor if you're going to have your motorcycles inside. I mean, I guess I got lucky or something. Because I always have fans on and I'm always hot, so I always have a fan on or air conditioner or something. So I guess I got lucky, but shoot, that was scary. <laughs> totally blowed myself up. I've had so many like near death close calls, like not near death that I was dead or anything, but like things where I yeah I should have died like countless times like I tried to count one day of all the close calls because there's so many and I'm like I don't know I ran out of fingers and I'm like yeah it's, it's enough I don't need to keep thinking about these things but there's some reason I'm here I don't know we'll see we'll see why am I here okay let's have another oyster too much talking where's my beer all right we got another one you want another oyster camp survivor I know. you wouldn't believe some of this stuff. and people have said it to me they're like i can't believe you're alive they say that to me you know it's like i'm like what really and then i think about what just happened i'm like oh yeah i guess it was bad huh i mean it's too too it's weird i don't know so i guess i'm supposed to do something on the planet before i croak all right here i'm gonna find, try to put you on the oyster camp hold on Pornographic. <laughs> Pretty good though. Oh, that one left. Right here. You can't switch down that box. It's getting kind of bluish outside. Oh, they took that car. It's gone, baby. $400. Well, it used to be $400. God knows how much it is now. And it was $400 in the 90s. Date this guy, he'd always get his car towed. I'm like, how do you always get your car towed? He'd get all these tickets, they would boot it, and I'd have to drive him down to the place, and it was a whole drama. I'm like, what are you doing? Just pay your ticket. <laughs> he was just so mad he got a ticket, he's like, I don't want to deal with it. You'd open up his glove box, there's all these tickets. <laughs> like, what are you doing? What are you doing with your life? 
Look, oh, there's the next guy. You see him? I think that's the next car to be towed right there. Possibly, I don't know. Oh no, he's driving away. He got lucky. Man, they don't play here. Don't park. <laughs> if you don't know what you're doing, you need to pay attention to these crazy signs. Oh my god, I'm like worn out. That ocean took it out of me today. I didn't swim that long. I did do a little run beforehand and I started going back to the gym, so I'm probably just worn out. Oh my god. So I'm gonna be at the um, little is it wetlands tomorrow morning while I'm waiting for my car to be fixed. We can like check out birds in the wetlands tomorrow morning if you want. <laughs> if anybody feels like it. Because it won't be copyrighted. Like here there's damn music everywhere, but that might be fun. We walk around, so you do, it's basically like Venice slash Marina del Rey area. Might be fun. Here, this so this you can see the light. Oh. Alright, we have one more to get down here. We can walk around a little bit. It's still nice out, look. There's like, still light and... And there's a bunch of cool, like, like downtown's pretty neat. Yeah, the neon is amazing. Reverse. You would, maybe. Yeah, birds. Another beer, but... Oh, it's the fucking angel's flight. You know this? Sorry. It's right there. These two little trolley things go up and down, up and down, up and down. I rode it a long time ago. And they, then they had some weird crash where some guy fucking died. They come like really close to each other. They shut it down for a while. I'm sorry. I'm like, I mishmash my stories. I get so excited, I start in the middle and just spread out from there. But anyway, yeah, so this thing goes up and down, up and down. See the little thing right there? It goes all the way up. So basically they built this in the like 20s or something. I don't know, it was a long time ago. And they call it Angel's Flight. I don't know if you can see the name on there. But then it goes up and down the hill. So you don't have to walk up and down that damn hill. It's pretty cool. So how's everybody doing? Everybody having a, a good day, a bad day? Tell me all your problems. <laughs> I'll eat oysters and listen. Maybe I should do like a... Uh, I'll start with like free like group coaching calls, right? Everybody will just call in and do like the Zoom and just like dish your stuff or whatever and then after like a couple months I'll be like okay now it's like 20 bucks a person <laughs> right what's your hook I don't know I have to do something I can't keep doing this old business anymore I need to let it die okay I'm gonna do the last one you ready ready uh, what's that hanging off there hold on Camp. That was amazing though. That was really good. I'm happy. Yay, I got to eat something. I was so hungry. Oh yeah, I was like, protein smoothies. protein smoothies. So that's what's that? Two bananas, a couple of tapes, and like, I basically didn't really eat. And the beer is the oyster. And about salad later. Sort of healthy. Quite healthier than most of you. All the like green juice and stuff I'm eating all the time. And all the freaking fruit. Oh my god, I eat a lot of fruit. And the raw nuts. I started doing the. You guys know about um like it's, it's weird. Nobody does it. So you take nuts, right, and you soak them 
so they have this internal sprouting that happens, right? And then you dehydrate them. Like say you have a, an oven that's basically almost off. It's like so low. It's like 110 degrees or something or 120 degrees. So you put your stuff in there and you let them kind of dry out for a couple days. And then you put it like in your little bag and you put it back in the fridge. So they look like regular nuts, but now they are internally sprouted, right? And so you have, it takes the, I guess it's called phytate on there, right? Because normally the, the nuts have all these things. And so when you eat the nut, you don't get like hardly any of the nutrients. So if you do this process, now you not only get rid of the phytates, now it's actually sprouted and it's like so nutrient dense, right? So you're getting the bang for your buck with your food, but you know, you got it's raw food, you know, you gotta buy all those raw nuts, and it's whatever. It's a pain in the ass, but I mean, it's better than like spending time waiting in the hospital, you know what I mean? <laughs> we gotta like spend money on good food, and you know, you can still have a beer every once in a while, and a raw oyster or whatever, you know? I mean, probably tonight I would do. Um, I have this like parasite cleanse drops. So definitely take those. Whenever I have like any sort of seafood, I take that just to make sure, you know, because of like aerosmith and all these horrible things we don't want to talk about. But yeah, so I don't know. I'm trying to be as healthy as I can, but I still want to have fun, you know. And uh, yeah, I don't want to be like orthorexic or anything. You know, these people that are like so worried about every little thing they put in their mouth and. Like, that's fine. You can do that for maybe like a month and kind of do a cleanse or something. Like, I was doing the six week thing with the raw food. I think it was like 98% raw or something. I think I had a couple cooked nuts made in a restaurant or whatever. But, but whatever, I wasn't freaking out. I'm like, whatever, I still got to function. You know what I mean? Because there's, uh, you have to go out with your friends to dinner. And what are you going to like not eat and sit there with your water? Come on. You got to eat something. So, and then, you know, I had a, I, during the cleanse, I did have a drink or two here and there. <laughs> that was like a perfect cleanse or anything. But you know what? You gotta make it workable. If I like you eat it. <laughs> nice. Okay. Oh, wait! You're on vacation here? I just saw this. Sorry, I'm behind on the chat here. So where are you? Are you just doing like a staycation? Or are you like in the Caribbean? Where are you? <laughs> Alcohol doesn't get anything. From Venice. Oh, okay. I know. I'm sort of on vacation from there too, huh? Well, first I got irritated because I don't like when people, I get bit by the night bot sometimes. I space out and I forget how many fucking emojis is the limit, you know? I'm like, fucking five unicorns, you know? I don't know. And then it's like, it's like, the punishment is worse than the crime, you know? They're gonna fucking erase you if you put one too many emoji. It's like, dude, you fucking know me. Or, I don't know. I don't know if it's a live person or it's automated. I think it goes on and off, right? So, I'm like, look. I was there when there was no fucking camera. Give me a break. We're fucking holding the thing together and there's no fucking camera. What is that? We're all nuts. <laughs> yeah, I knew it was a software, but I know like you can program it to say certain things when certain things happen, right? But there, I think there's a thing where you can like manually control it because I noticed some of the messages are different when the same thing happens. So I'm like, I don't know if I got the automated message or like somebody was there. I think I got the automated one and it was fucking harsh, you know? So I was like, bye. <laughs> That's how I am. When I get bit, I go away for a while. And then I tiptoe back in, but whatever. It's no big deal. I wish I was there. I mean, my boyfriend wanted to go to Thailand. I mean, cause I like that Thailand camp. It's cool. But I was, what was I freaked out about? I think they had too many restrictions, like with all the, you know, health stuff going on or whatever. But you know, since I try to be healthy, 
I, uh, I don't take medication and stuff like that, and like unless I'm fucking dying, you know, and I'm like, okay, give me the medication, you know. Like I gotta be in a, I gotta be in a bad way to take some medication. You know, I know it's there, and now it's gonna work on me because I don't take it, you know what I mean? So, but you know, they want to force you to have whatever, and I'm like, yeah, I don't, I don't want to. It's open July 1st, really. Because we're trying to figure out a place to go in September. I don't know what the weather is like there in September. Oh, it's always hot. But I was, I was kind of holding out for Bali to completely drop all the restrictions, because they still have restrictions. Sorry, my finger. I'm on the wrong side for the chat. Let's see. A little wet, bad, does you good. Yeah, so, I mean, whatever. I try to do the best I can, and, uh, I, I, you know, I tried that perfect thing a long time ago, and it, it is the worst, you know. Because you're always going to fucking dive under the wheel of the wagon, you know what I mean, or whatever. You, there's no perfection. It doesn't work. I mean, I, I've seen it, too. I've seen these people do it. Oh, God, it's my battery dying. Hold on. Oh, Jesus, I'm not at 8%. I got a thing in the car, though. I have a charger in the car. Maybe I should get the charger and we can walk around a little bit. Alright, we're gonna hit it. Thank you so much! It was amazing! <laughs> okay. Let's uh, get waste your breath now. I'm thinking we'll go to the car and get the charger, and then we can walk around here. Oh, my boyfriend's calling. Hold on, let me tell, tell him. Uh, can I call you back later? I really have to work on my... I need to make my own messages. You know how the text, it's got the little pre-written messages? Like, there's some cool buildings down here. He says, yes, I can call him back later. I'm sorry, I'm like zoomed in. There we go. The AT&T Tower. It's kind of ugly, right? Yeah, but we get signal, bitches! <laughs> and there's some apartments. A lot of apartments now. A lot of apartments. I'm too many people out right now. That might be a fun thing to do, to like come in the daytime when there's people everywhere down here. Because of course there's like the skid row down there. It's super sketchy though. So, I don't know. The Ford. Okay. So yes, buildings, buildings. This is where I'm parked. Should I get some, uh, hold on, I'll turn you around. Oh, am I missing messages? Time for you to get started on dinner. Okay, bye Fortuna. So what do you think, should I get the charger when we can like cruise around a little more? Like check it out, there's some like cool buildings and stuff. I don't wanna like get run over here. Charger. You're gonna go? Oh, everybody's leaving. Okay. <laughs> Anybody staying on? Let's see. We got, hold on. We got 7%. We could mess around for 7%. Should we go in the tunnel? Did I show you the tunnel yet? Oh, somebody's smoking weed. Oh, let's go to the tunnel! No, we'd always go like rev the bikes in the tunnel. In the middle of the night we come down here in the middle of the night and ride bikes downtown so fun it's loud as hell too in the damn in the damn tunnel oh my god let's see here it's crazy yeah please you want to walk around okay so maybe i should grab mine it's okay to grab the crap out of your car right i hate the damn money oh wait i have a charger in my purse hey <laughs> Look at this, we got a charger. It's the little like, credit card one or whatever. Here, I'm gonna plug you in. There we go. We are charging, bitches, yes. Okay, I gotta put the little rubber band thing around it. Okay, I gotta tie my shoe, I'm a mess. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, charger's on. You skated. <laughs> 
used to be skater girl. Little skate punk girl. Well, check out this cool building over here. Oh, there's the moon up there. See the moon? There's the moon. And here's the cool building. Oh, the lighting's a little bad, but... It's got these cool tiles on it. I don't know if you can see the tiles, though. Oh, that's too bad. You're younger. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can't do the skating much anymore. Here. <clears throat> I'm going to put you down while I tie my shoe. Hold on. It's like we're friends and we're hanging out. And then, hold on, i got to tie my shoe. <laughs> okay. So let's cruise down on that cool street with the, uh, the cool building. Gotta make sure we're not. There's <laughs> not too many sketchy people. It's, it's weird because there's like strange pockets here where all of a sudden you're in a bad area. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like, oh no! <laughs> Get me the hell out of here. And I don't have any pepper spray or anything on me. I got my phone in the air. Okay, right now it seems okay. Right now we're cool. Here. I'm gonna turn you around so you can see what's going on. drive super fast be careful it's pretty dead right here oh look at this fucking building holy shit look at this it's got the wild it's got little different faces on it you see them There's a cool little cutout thing up there. Hold on. Whoa. <laughs> I'm trying to get it so it's not totally. Let's see. It's got these cool little S thingies on it. Super cool building. See, that's the cool thing about downtown. They have the cool as shit stuff, you know? I mean, look at this ornate situation here. How did he get up there to tag it? What? Oh. Well, it's kind of peaceful right here, to be honest. I think it's the energy of this building. It's like calming things right here. Oh my god, do you see this? It's got these, uh... What is that, a cow skull or something? A bull skull? <laughs> is that a real skull? Wait, what is happening? There it is. <laughs> oh, I spit it all on beer, I'm sorry. <laughs> You want to close up here? <laughs> What's your name? What is it? Mario. Mario. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Good. <laughs> we love it. Good job. <laughs> so you got to make friends with the locals and they'll look out for you. No, he seems nice. Oh, there's another cow, cow skull. <laughs> Anyway, you're probably bored with this fucking building forever. <laughs> wait, there's, wait, there's more shit. Hold on, sorry. I'm not supposed to be cursing as much anymore. I'm sorry. I'm trying to clean up my act here. <laughs> I had a beer, so I'm like, oh, look, there's these ladies. Do you see the lady? Is she naked? She's naked. <laughs> She's naked. I don't think you can see it very well. Oh, there's another one. Look, there's another lady. Wow. She's playing a guitar, banjo or something. She's playing some sort of instrument there. And there's more ladies. Wait, I'm gonna bring you over to see the other ladies. There they are. Oh, look at this like goddess. She's like the siren. I know, where are the gargoyles? Well, underneath her something. I don't know what the hell that thing is. It is terrifying though. Like, oh, it's a, you know what it is? It's like a, a what are they called? A buffalo head or something, right? It looks like a buffalo. I think it's a buffalo. And then there's this other person. It's kind of Peter Panish, and they're playing this <laughs> instrument. Hello, baby! <laughs> Hot shot. Okay. 
Oh my god. Oh, there's something else over here. Hold on. What is that? There's another little dude above the door. Oh, uh, loot. Oh, bison. Okay, you guys know. <laughs> you guys know all this stuff. <laughs> my arm's getting tired. Okay, hold on. Okay. Da, 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 da. You swear like a trooper? My boyfriend's always on me. He's like, you're getting older. You probably shouldn't be talking that way. I'm like, yeah, I know. But I'm a motorcycle chick and we're like wild and crazy, right? <laughs> He's like trying to keep me out of trouble, I think. The Bradbury building. Wait, that's famous. Bradbury. Oh, wait, my friend worked on this. He restored it. Oh, my God. We got to go look at that. Hold on. I don't want to get run over. I, this, is, this is the problem. Miss Unicorn over here is staring at the sky, walking across the street. Can't mess around here. <laughs> I think you're run over. No, I just said saw this thing. They said two out of three people that get hit by a car are actually in the crosswalk. I'm like, oh my god, what? That's horrible. There's some guy and his dog. He lives in one of these towers over here. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. Oh, walk. Well, here we go. Two out of three people get hit in a crosswalk. I just saved everyone's lives here. <laughs> and we got them on camera so that they kill us. <laughs> Call the police. <laughs> oh, I got a new message about my Honda. I've had such like these creepy dudes lowballing me. It's fine. We'll return this call later. We're not showing a bike tonight. Broad Street Oyster Company. Now open. Is that where I was? <laughs> I don't have enough people hanging out in the corner, people with the masks, I'm not sure I, I don't know, whatever, we won't go into mask propaganda. <laughs> and another message about the motorcycle, can you hear the cha-ching when it comes in? Oh, look at these people, oh my god, they just got married, it's the fucking chapel, sorry, I'm not cursing. <laughs> That's it though? That's where they get married, in the office? Okay. Oh look, you can buy your wedding dress right here. Because, you know, you can't be doing white anymore. Come on. Unless, I mean, you're the ultimate virgin, like her. And, hey, you know, whatever. And we got the quinceanera dresses. Somebody's playing a guitar over here. Should we go see him? Oh, look, there's more wedding dresses. Oh, check out these dresses. Oh, sorry, you guys don't want to see dresses. <laughs> I forgot there's no girls on. <laughs> okay. Can you see that? Wait, do you want to see the guitar guy? Hold on. Hold on. Wah. There he is. He's playing his guitar. Ring. Oh, you heard the ring? Okay. I was like, oh, I don't know if you can hear it. <sighs> hey, <laughs> how's it going? <laughs> Good. Ooh, happy hour. Woo, wait. <laughs> uh oh, we got a happy hour. I'm going to get in trouble. <laughs> I'm going to be in trouble. Oh, it smells like food here. <clears throat> oh dear, I don't have any fucking pepper spray. You know what? I'm fine. Oh look, look at the cool, you can see the sun. Hold on. I missed the shot. Hold on. Zah! Look at that. What? <laughs> now this is the building you always see in the movies. It used to not have the U.S. Bank thing on the top of it, but you always see helicopters flying around it in the movies. They always have this thing in all the L.A. movies. They have all the action flicks and stuff. <clears throat> I mean, it's, it's, you know, it is what it is. But what's back here? Is this just like a restaurant? Let's just go check it out. Sneak around over here and see what's back here. Oh, look at the last blocks. This is kind of cool. Look at the sky, it looks pretty today. We got wonderful, beautiful people eating. And then there's some weird, I don't know, there's some other building. What is this? Artisan pasta. Oh, fuck, this is like homemade pasta. What? I mean, you know, if it's homemade, I might try it. 
Look at that one. I've never even seen that shit before. Ooh, look at these biggies, thickies. <laughs> We got these cool little cookie jars up here. I know. Oh, there's more pasta up there. Look. Oh my god. Look at that big red one. Oh wow. These are cool. Oh, the squid ink pasta, the black one. What? Now we gotta keep an eye out, make sure there's no weirdos behind us. Okay. We're safe. Oh, the clown! What? That's cool. I doubt any of these are for sale. These are like their little special things. But there's a guy in there. Oh, sorry. I'm being rude. There's a dude. I thought it was closed. Look at this. It's got a little tray with everything. Oh, wow. Look at this for fall. Uh, the bow tie pasta. What are those? I've never seen that pasta before. Look at the shells. There's just stuff, stuff in those, right? <laughs> stuff stuff <laughs> one beer like in the nutcase <laughs> should we go have a margarita <laughs> no I actually did a, a drunken live stream the other night but nobody came on thank god <laughs> me and my girlfriend she has a swing inside of her house so we're swinging 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 what is this weird art we're swinging we're wasted it was hilarious I don't know should I put it up <laughs> should I release it <laughs> two drunk girls I forgot what I titled it. And <laughs> nobody ever came on. I'm like, okay. Okay. Let's go check it out. Make it public. <laughs> oh, fuck. I think I had one pervert on I had to block. What was he saying? He said something. Oh, look, there's some good uh, fate. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Should I put it up? <laughs> If I'm gonna be like a, a life coach, should I have wild things out there? Maybe I should do the life coach on a different channel. I don't know. Oh, there's the other side of the building. Wait, we didn't see all this. Oh, we missed half of the stuff. Damn, this building just doesn't quit. Wow. Hermi, Herme, Herme, Her how do you say it? Hermes, Hermes, Hermes. That's it. Yeah. That's some pricey stuff, man. All right, it's kind of dead down here. Uh, there's like people hanging out and stuff. We're fine. There's nobody around. You always run into the street if you have to. Many people like me. I'm fine. <laughs> to watch where you step though <laughs> yeah it's kind of nice when these are all open this is not the place to be now this is more like a daytime place it's another old building well, the light is nice right here right now though look how nice the light is those are apartments these are apartments. Dude, that'd be wild living in one of those vintage buildings. The radiator. They had the little cranes on top so you can get your uh, your piano in the house or whatever right through the window or something. Oh, my windows are small though. I don't know what that is for. <laughs> What's a crane? Alright. Alright. I guess we're going to head back. Yeah, time to get out of there. Yeah. I don't feel unsafe or anything. Usually I, I can feel the vibes, right? I'm the vision girl, so I'm pretty good about these things. Most of the time, fear is like in your heart, right? So if you can get rid of that, then you can actually pick up on the energies around you. Like here is fucking dead. There's nothing. Nothing's happening. If there's any bad people, they're asleep. Thank God. <laughs> oh, look at this one. Hold on, let's see if I can zoom in. I'm blinded by the light here. Oh, another message about the Honda. It's probably the same guy. You know, you always get one guy. 
she didn't take my offer. Some of these people are aggressive. Hold on, I'm trying to get you this. Here it is. Can you see this? Lust. <laughs> graffiti lust. <laughs> this graffiti is funny. All right, my arm, my arm. What is today? Wednesday? King, King Trivia. It's seven. What time is it? Six twenty-six. Four dollars for a beer. We paid three fifty next door. Eight dollar margarita. Oh, there I am. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> See, it's more fun when there's people around. They can talk to people. You know, I love that stuff. But like, nah, nobody's looking at me or nothing. They're, everybody's tired. We need to come out like in the morning. Everybody's rushing to work. That might be fun. The local, the stow. Oh, he's smoking a fucking big joint right there. <laughs> Holy smokes, he's strong. Oh, here's the building. Wait, it's got like a sea nymph or something on it. I'm sorry, is, the, is this boring, the building here? Is that a sea nymph? Does she have a leg? I don't think it's a sea nymph. She's got a leg. There's another lady. And there's a dude over here. Was there a lot of graffiti? What was that? Somebody broke something. I'm trying to focus. Stop distracting me. <laughs> the dude who ever dropped something. <laughs> he just dragged me. Oh wait, there's what is that? Is that sort of like a gargoyle -y thing? It's like sticking out. There's another one on the other side. I think they're lions, maybe. Look at this. Wow. This is crazy. I like all the stars. Blah, blah, blah. The lobster rules. <laughs> oh, wait, there's some more people. Hold on. Ah! Okay. Where do you live, uh, Art? Are you here? Are you in LA? I know your people have probably told me before. Oh, we were supposed to check out the building that I spaced out on. The Bradbury building. This is one of my friend. Oh, this is the one that was in Blade Runner. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. My friend actually restored this building. He was like the main guy. It's like fucking amazing inside. Can you see it? It's got these cool elevators in there that like those metal ones and there's this huge opening inside i'm sure you guys probably know what that is i wonder if there's any more windows you can't really see much here you can't see a lot anyway it's a cool building <laughs> take my word for it if you go online you can like if you ever saw the damn Blade Runner, he's, uh, you know, in that building. <laughs> and he goes now, it's got a coffee on the other side. Oh, oh my god. Alright. I think I'm done. Oh, hold on. I think I unplugged my charger. Hold on. Ah! Oh, my charger may have died. Hold on. Did it die? Hold on. I got no brightness. I can't see anything. Oh, there we go. Oh, I think my charger's dead. It wasn't all the way charged. I got 5% though. So that's fine. So I'll turn around. Alright, so I guess we're going to call it a night here. Hold on. Did I miss any messages before I go? Oh, you can't go in right now. It's closed. Uh, it's so hard to film anywhere in LA. Everybody's like super strict. You kind of gotta like do it on the DL. Night, you! I'm just gonna walk back to the car. I'm just up the street here. I guess I got 5% of my arms dying. <laughs> We've been going for an hour and 20 minutes. Thanks for uh, coming to the Oyster Fest. That was fun. Oh, I didn't actually I need to cross the street. <laughs> We're both running. <laughs> Oh, I like your Superman socks. <laughs> Those are awesome. Oh, he's got the cool uh, crown tattoo, too. Okay, let's go. So picking on the locals. 
Right, darling. So there's another old building. I might have seen that one already. I don't know what this one's called. I keep looking and there's more stuff higher up. There's like bunnies kissing or something way up there. Do you want to see the bunnies kissing? How do they have graffiti all the way at the top? How? What the fuck? They scaled the building? Oh, sorry. I thought it was the other way. <laughs> Hold on. Look at this. I'm trying to find the bunnies. There they are. Cheers, Art! There's bunnies kissing, sort of. <laughs> oh, thanks, Roy! I know, I almost bailed on the whole idea, but then... I was like, you know, fuck it. It's worth the ten dollars to have a fun little stream and maybe some oysters. Hi! <laughs> so that was perfect. See? Right when I thought I had nothing, the oyster showed up. <laughs> All right, so we go back to the car. Go back to my little car. My snowball. She's waiting for me. Yeah, I'll show you the rest of the. The sun's going down. There's the old uh, LA Times building over there. Is that interesting or no? It's boring. <laughs> it's kind of cool. It's got the little clock on it. The Times. I actually used to get that. Jason Statham. Actually, my boyfriend looks like Jason Statham. Except for like, he's got more muscles. <laughs> Poor Jason better get back to the gym. He can't keep up with my boy. <laughs> no, he does. He has that weird, like, rugged <laughs> uh, machismo thing. He's definitely machismo. He's a walking animal. Oh, my God. I'm exhausted. Thank you, guys. It was so much fun. Here, I want to put my keys. Yeah, it was totally chill down here. Maybe another day, we'll do a daytime one. Oh, I'll try to find my keys. In here somewhere. Ugh. Oh, I had them in my pocket a minute ago. Here they are, they're in my pocket. I'm like panicking. I'm like, I'm gonna lose my, I lost my keys the other day. At the pool. Somebody turned them in though, so. Thank God. All right, we're here. We're queer, get used to it. <laughs> Just kidding. All right. Love you guys. Thanks for coming. It was fun. Little DTLA. And um, whatever. We'll see you soon. I'll see you all uh, by, you know, wherever. Maybe <laughs> at the chat. All right. Bye. Bye. Love you. <laughs>